There's no need to get tense. Relax with Flux Condenser. Subscribe, baby, subscribe. As an antique radio collector, I got pretty tired of the limited AM broadcasting available. So I purchased an AM transmitter, hooked my iPhone to it, and voila, I had my very own AM radio station and could broadcast whatever I pleased. But then I started wondering, if one AM transmitter and one AM radio can play in mono, could two AM transmitters and two radios play in stereo? Well, it turns out they can. Here we have a transmitter broadcasting at 1025 kilocycles and a second transmitter broadcasting at 1550 kilocycles. We also have an AirPlay base station and its left output is connected to the 1025 transmitter and the right output is connected to the 1550 transmitter. And here we have 13 antique radios, but we're only concerned with two of them right now. Look on the left and right of the center row and you'll see two FATA bullets. The orange and red bullet is tuned to 1025 kilocycles, so it'll receive and play the left channel of our stereo broadcast. The brown and orange bullet is tuned to 1550 kilocycles, and it'll receive and play the right channel. So now, when I send stereo music to the AirPlay base station, I get stereo sound from the combination of the two old FATA bullets. How does it sound? Put on some stereo headphones because I'm about to show you. And oh, if you want to learn more about my antique radio restorations and about the transmitters, check out more of my YouTube channel. But for now, let's enjoy a little antique radio sound in stereo.